Department of Education Secretary and Vice President Sara Duterte emphasized that President Ferdinand Marcos Jr. has already ordered them to conduct study on how to provide salary increases for teachers aside from what they annually receive under the salary standardization law. So we're waiting uh, for the results of that study na uh, nandoon yung increases and then nandoon din yung um, pagkumpara niya sa inflation at sa mga economic indicators, forecast ng economic indicators sa mga darating na taon. VP Sara and President Marcos were both present during the Brigada Escuela activities of the DepEd at the Victorino Mapa High School in Barangay San Miguel, Manila, where the latter also donated 1 million pesos to the school in addition to paints and cleaning materials. Meanwhile, President Marcos expressed his support for DepEd's Matatag curriculum, saying it is a significant program suited for Filipino students. PBBM emphasized that the new curriculum aims to strengthen the country's international score, especially when it comes to science, technology, and mathematics subjects. It's uh, very significant because here we are trying ang sinusubo pa natin gawin kung ay ayusin ang curriculum para maging mas patay sa panangailangan ng mga patang Pilipino. Kasi na kasama na rin dahil ng mga takto ay includes especially when it comes to uh, STEM, uh, STEM subjects. Uh, also, binibigyan natin, binibigyan natin ng pagkakataon yung mga after 10th uh, grade na mamili kung sila ay mag-vocational, uh, mag, uh, mag-technical training o itutuloy nila. The DepEd recently launched the Matatag curriculum which aims to decongest the current K-12 curriculum and which includes a reduction in the number of competencies and is more focused on development of foundational skills such as literacy, numeracy, and socio-emotional skills for kindergarten to grade 3. Nel Maribuhok, UNTV News and Rescue, we serve the people, we give glory to God.